Hello learners, welcome to the video. In today's video, we'll be discussing about the nomads who live in the mountains and their cyclical grazing movement. Let's take a look at the topics that we'll be discussing in this video. Who are nomads? Who are Gurjar Bakarwals? Who are the Gaddi Shepherds? How did they herd their cattle in the cyclical grazing movement? While traveling to other states, you must have noticed a person walking with a large number of sheep or goats around him on the road and guiding them towards a pasture of green land. Who are these people? These are nomads. Nomads are people who do not live in one place but move from one area to another to earn their living. Whenever we are studying the history of a country, we mostly don't read about nomads because they don't play a very important role in changing the history of a country. But pastoralism has been important in many countries like India and Africa. We'll be learning about two such tribes found in the mountain region of India. Firstly, we'll be discussing the Gujar Bakarwals of Jammu and Kashmir. They are great herders of goat and sheep. They were not always found in Jammu and Kashmir. But during the 19th century, many of them migrated there in search of pasture for their animals. Now, what happens when these mountains get covered with snow during the winter season? The nomads move towards the low hills of the Sivalik range with their herds. The dry scrub forests here provide pasture for their herds. When the summers start arriving, that is by the end of April, the snow starts melting from the mountains. They start moving backwards towards the high mountains in the north. A variety of grasses grow in this region which provide rich, nutritious forage for the animal herds. This journey back is done in huge groups where several households come together and this is known as kafala. September end brings back the winter in the high mountains and the herds start moving back towards the low hills. The other tribe that we'll be discussing is the Gadi Shepherds of Himachal Pradesh. They also have a similar seasonal movement where winters are spent in the lower Sivalik range and the summers are spent in the Lahul and Spiti. Now, as some Gujar Bakarwals had moved to Jammu and Kashmir in the 19th century, many Gujar cattle herders, which were already residing there, decided to move towards up hills near Garhwal and Kumau in search of pastures. In these hills, these herders came down to the dry forest of the Babar in the winter and went up to the high meadows known as the Bugyals in the summer. Now this pattern of moving between summers and winters was very common amongst the other communities of Himalayas as well as the Bhutiyas, Sherpas and Kinauris. Can you think of the benefit which came from this cyclical movement? With the movement of the herds to a different area, there was no shortage of food for the cattle. It allowed the soil to replenish itself and gave crops time to grow. This was all about the nomads found in the mountain area and the cyclical movement they follow. Let's take a recap of what we have learned so far. Nomads are people who do not live in one place but move from one area to another to earn their living. The Gujar Bakarwals of Jammu and Kashmir are great herders of goat and sheep. During winters, they move towards the low hills of Sivalik range with their herds. When the summers start arriving, that is by the end of April, they start moving back towards the high mountains in the north. The Gati shepherds of Himachal Pradesh follow similar seasonal movements where winters are spent in the lower Sivalik range and the summers are spent in the Lahul and Spiti. The benefit of this cyclical movement was there was no shortage of food for the cattle and this allowed the soil to replenish itself as well as gave crops time to grow. That's all in today's video. Thanks for watching.